this is the second year of a bio car at Tech, and uh, it's another learning experience. It's a uh, whole new drivetrain, whole new uh, uh, expanded concept of the uh, the, the yeast and, and water reaction, and uh, we're just trying to optimize it again, make it go, dial it in, get it get at the distance and the. Uh, the reliability that we need. We don't know who's going to bring a bio car. Last year there were only three bio cars, I think Auburn and another university. And um, uh, uh, I think we got two feet away from the line, and the next closest was somewhere around like maybe 10 or so feet away from the line. So it, it wasn't really close last year, but this year we really don't know what's going to happen. Well, we build up the, put all the yeast and glucose in this container, where we, and uh, we have both tanks, so we bring, build up pressure in both. Uh, we have this digital pressure gauge here, which is where we monitor the overall pressure because uh, these containers are only rated to, for max operating pressure of uh, 125 psi, so we monitor it so we don't get it uh, close to that. We have relief valves on it uh, that pop at 115, so we don't even get over 115. Um, uh, we have another relief valve here, so if we want to try and set it to an accurate uh, pressure, we can bleed off a little bit of pressure that's not going through the wheels um, to try and get it to a certain number. And then uh, just to run it, once we build up the pressure, we just relieve, uh, open this valve here, and, sends it through the pneumatic uh, engine right here which connects to the wheels and just sends it along. Well right now it's, uh, this year's model is a lot heavier than last year so right now uh, distance wise we're uh, still working, we're in progress with that so it's a work in progress and also right now today is the first day we're actually getting ready to, um, we got the pressure up to a certain extent so hopefully uh, it'll go the distance we want. We're, we're trying to get it up to 100 feet. Right now, uh, the most we can get it is at 40 feet. So right now, it's kind of a, a battle to, you know, uh, get it where we want it. But right now, it's a work in progress. I mean, it's exciting. Um, you get to work on team building skills because there's a lot of, there's eight people working on this car. So you get to really work on those type of skills. And it's a fun project. It's not just, you know, you go up and present. You actually go and you physically, physically compete. I'm a real competitive person. I like to, you know, I like to, I like to win the trophy. So this is a great um, way of, of doing that in actual in a classroom setting where you learn something at the same time. So.